Sire, I have more news. Um, yes. Well, it seems that the fighting has gone Enough. exactly as you... I would like to know what you intend to accomplish, Father. Should we not be fighting the Darkspawn instead of each other? The nobility should be brought into line and then the Darkspawn defeated. This is no true blight, Anora. Only Kalen's vanity demanded it be so. Beg pardon, sire. But blight or no, we may not have the manpower to face the Darkspawn soon. Kalen approached your legions for support, did he Never. not? Never! Marek and I drove those bastards out! Not roll out the welcome for the now. We need help, Father. We cannot deal with this crisis alone. Ferelden will stand on its own. I will lead it through this, Anora. You must have faith in me. Did you kill Kalen? Kalen's death was his own doing. Concentrate, like we practiced. Now, fire! Never any shortage of these. Let's do this quickly! Yes. I'm taking these apprentices to Redcliffe. The first enchanter says you need every able-bodied mage for the war. They're young, but capable enough, as you saw. Dwarven craft. Fine dwarven craft. I recognize you from Ostagar. And trust this blood. You're a Grey Warden. Duncan's apprentice. You killed my friend and good King Kalen. I demand satisfaction, sir. Pardon me, sir. You must think I'm a fool. You really do look like... Uh, too much ale, yes. Uh, too much. Uh, excuse me.
Yes. What are you doing here? No. No, I am Waylon, Brother Genitivi's assistant. When you first came in, I was... was hoping that you had news of Brother Genitivi. Wishful thinking, it seems. I haven't seen Brother Genitivi in weeks. He said no word. It's so unlike him. I am afraid something has happened. Genitivi's research into the urn may have led him into danger. Perhaps the urn has been lost for a reason. I pray for Genitivi's safety, but hope dwindles with each passing day. I, I tried to send help, but some knights came from Redcliffe looking for him not long ago. I sent them after Genitivi, and they too have disappeared. Now don't ask me where they went. You'll go after them. And what if ill luck should befall you too? This search is a curse on all of us. Some things are, are not meant to be found. I know that now. <sighs> so be it. All he said before he left was that he would be staying at an inn near Lake Callenhard, investigating something in that area. Good luck. May you find the answers you seek. Do you think they sell silk ribbons in that store? I've been meaning to spruce up my boots for the longest time. Thank the maker, my brother and his family made it out of Lodi. He said that the dark. You here to report another crime? I swear we should just cordon off the entire district. Oh, uh, can I help you, Warden? What? You're serious? I mean, yes, yes, I could use help. I've got a pretty popular uh, establishment that's crawling with mercenaries. If I send my boys in, someone might get, make a forbid, hurt, and I'll have to explain to their noble fathers that being a guard is actually dangerous. The name of the whorehouse is the Pearl. Beat down any mercenaries that are out of line and send them a message. I said, beat down, not kill. Let me make that really clear, not on fire, or exploded, or make a nose, whatever type of grisly death you can dream up. Sorry. Used to giving orders to my boys. Just leave them breathing and I'll be happy. Thank you, Warden. Happy hunting. Leave me to my business. I hear your daughter came down with the blight. No, it was my brother's daughter. Terrible. Dwarven craft. Find dwarven craft. Wrecked from Orzammar. You won't find better. All men are the work of our maker's hand. From the
touch nothing. I don't think they clean the surfaces in this place very often. Stop playing games, That's Scamp Kylon sent you, right? I think he's Glad he hasn't forgotten about us. Anything. The mercenaries are right there. If you're here about other things, just speak up. Someone needs to put you in your place. Grey Warden. And I had heard that all the Ferelden Wardens were killed or exiled from this place. Oh, don't look so surprised. I've seen many of your kind in my journeys, and there is always something... odd about you. Huh. Strong hands. Could I entice you to leave your order and sign up as one of my crewmen? I could use those strong hands at my... helm. The ship is the best teacher. She will guide you with her sighs, her shudders, her gentle swaying as she rides the crests of the waves. When you become one with her, instinct takes over. I assume you saw that little drama. None of these poor brutes has ever proven a match for me. They are too clumsy and predictable. I fight with quickness and wit rather than with brute force and strength. I call myself a duelist because I honed my skills in duels with warriors I encountered over the years. As I said, it is better to avoid being hit, and it is best not to get into fights at all. <laughs> An unusual request, coming from a fearsome slayer of Darkspawn. I am flattered that you wish to learn from me, sweet thing. But I have watched you, and you seem to lack a particular grace that is required. You are accustomed to doing battle a certain way, yes? I can teach you some basics. Perhaps you can pass it on to someone who might be interested in what I have to offer. I do, however, wish to get to know my potential student better. So we shall call for a drink, and you will honor me with a game. Have you ever played Wicked Grace? It is easy to learn, but difficult to master. You must watch your opponent's moves as carefully as your own. Before we start, the cards must be shuffled. Shall I, or would you like to? Very well. There. That should be sufficient. Five cards each to start with. And may the cleverest player win. Ah, a wonderful card for me. You certainly have quick reflexes. I'm quite impressed. And as for me cheating, well, the game does not matter. I just wanted to see if you could outwit me. You have proven yourself quick and resourceful, and I would be honored to pass my skills on to you. Come, we will need some space for this. I don't think there's anything else I can teach you. Perhaps... I don't think there's anything else I can teach you. Perhaps tell those you meet where you learned what you know. I don't think there's anything else I can teach you. Perhaps tell those you meet where you learned what you know. Turn around and walk, stranger. This affair is for white falcons only. Get a load of this guard. You're telling us what to do? Uh, you have a point there. Man, let's clear out. Don't, don't want to get on Hokane's bad side, do we? Tell Kylon I owe him one. I don't think so.
Another Grey Warden supporter. Not just a supporter, Payton. That's a Grey Warden. He's the one Arl Howe was looking for. Our trap landed a Warden? You've got one chance to surrender. For what it's worth, I believe you. Not that I particularly care. <laughs> We're not common guards, Warden. We're Howe's elite. Shavra, Tenant, and Jarvi? Let's kill ourselves a Warden. I could do that for you. Welcome to the Pearl. I'm Sanga, the proprietor. Have a seat, get comfortable, and tell me what you need. Every one of my people here is a skilled craftsman, and don't let anyone tell you different. You'll have to go one at a time, I'm afraid. Our rooms aren't quite big enough to share between so many. But we can discuss that in a moment. So what would you like me to show you? The men or the women? Or some of both, if you prefer. Come again. I was hoping I'd find you. I heard about the Pearl. I don't know how, but you got them to leave with no fuss at all. The Pearl's workers will... Nobody gives orders to my men but me. A little lesson in respect is in order. I see. Don't bother sparing these louts. Things are about to get messy. Now, let's see. <laughs> <laughs> going. Going. All right. <laughs> People actually voluntarily attack you. Are they just stupid? There's the payment I promised. I might have more work if you're interested. But I'm heading back to the market district. Back alleys are just too dangerous for me. Now let's see which one now going. All right. Yeah. Yeah.
time for the ones that killed Roz. Get him. You! We're about to send the boys to hunt you down! Boss says kill him! Time for more practice. Going. <laughs> Me. I could do that for you. I could do that for you. Can't do that. So, tell me, how did you become a Grey Warden? Arl Rendon Howe? The Earl of Amaranthine? Why would he do such a thing to you? You are... You are the last of the Kooslands? I had no idea. My lord. Yes, I suppose so. You can no longer have a title, can you? But that does not mean you must forget utterly where you came from. Take heart, dear friend. 
You survived, even when you were not expected to. We do not know yet what lies in store for you, or the name you carry. It is not so bad, is it, being a Grey Warden? Sometimes it gives me comfort to think that everything will end up the way it's supposed to. That it will be all right. You were chosen. You survived the joining when others did not. Perhaps it was meant to be. Done, naturally. Time for more flesh.
out with it. Ready. Allow me. I could do that for you. I know not how you have survived thus far. Is it luck or providence? No matter. You will not survive this! We should do something. I must ask, what does being a Grey Warden mean to you? There's that, of course. But there's more to being a Grey Warden than killing Darkspawn and saving the world from the Blight. Ultimately, being a Grey Warden is about serving others, about serving all people, whether elves or dwarves or men. As a Grey Warden, you are a guardian of men, and you guard them because their continued existence is more important than you are. Thus it is you who serves, not they. A good king, a true king, who cares for his land, uses his power to rule firmly but fairly. He serves his people first and foremost. The king who does not do this, who believes that he is entitled to his power, who abuses it and uses it for his own means, is a tyrant. If you live apart from others, and your actions affect only you, then you may do as you wish. But if you have power, influence, and strength, your every action will be as a drop of water in a clear, still pond. The drop causes ripples, and ripples spread. Think of how far they will go, how wide they will become, how will they affect the pond. But I've lectured enough for today. I should stop before I wear out my welcome.
Over with. Blessed are the peacekeepers, champions of the just. Good to see you back. I've got complaints in the Nord Noble Tavern that some mercenaries have invaded. Nothing violent has happened. The cell swords are probably just disturbing the nobles' rarefied conversation. Just drum the louts out of there. The barkeep doesn't mind some blood, or sport as she called it. Captain said Denerim won't miss a few dead mercenaries. Do what you will, and good luck.
Good day, and welcome to the Spoiled Princess. Is there something I can get for you? It was my father's idea. He ran the inn before me, and he named it for my sister. She was his little princess. Princess decided the country was too dull for her and moved to Denerim. More glamorous, she said. Well, she was found murdered, robbed of all the trinkets my father bought her with his hard-earned money. My father died of shock and heartbreak. Mother stopped eating, and I got the struggling in. The name stuck. That's a story. Brother Jin... Uh, no, uh, no, of course not. I've never heard of him. No, no, I, I haven't seen any knights. Nonsense. Why would I lie to you? Listen, the person you're looking for isn't here. You should be on your way as soon as possible. me. I can't speak openly. Don't! Don't look around and keep your voice down. They're looking for anyone asking for this brother Genitivi. They told me to act like nothing's wrong and just deny ever having seen the brother or the knights. don't know. You should be on your guard and leave quickly. I don't know what happened to the knights, but I doubt it was anything good. Goodbye, and make her turn his gaze on you. How did a child survive that? The crater is still smoking. It's a boy. Five fingers, five toes. That's all that matters to me. The Maker has answered our prayers. Let's go home, Marta, and raise the Tyke as our own.
Get your horses off Van Talman's land. We won't bend needle Loghain. Loghain is the regent. He demands your... We're not Orlesian Lickspittles. We owe no man our allegiance. Leave! Take their lands by force, men. Regent's orders. All right. Show those Logan upstarts. <laughs> we show those Logan upstarts. Yes. Well, here I am. What is meant by someone like me? Did you think I was always a cloistered sister? The Chantry provides succor and safe harbor to all who seek it. I chose to stay and become affirmed. I was a traveling minstrel in Orlais. Tales and songs were my life. I performed, and they rewarded me with applause and coin. And my skill in battle? Well, you pick up different skills when you travel, yes? Yes, of course. Um, let's move on. No, this should be fun.
I see them. Dark form. Thank you, Maker. Thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you, Maker. Thank you, thank you. Men are the work of our nation. And after much sweat, blood and toil, her labors ended, and the world marveled at what she wrought. Those who bring ham. The maker does not bread.
you think the tower is ever going to get back to what it was, Wynne? I don't know. A great number of people died. It will be difficult to imagine rebuilding. That cloud hanging over everything for many years to come. Do you think you'll be there? To help rebuild, I mean, once this is all over with? I cannot say. Even if I survive this flight. Looks like the fighting is finally started. You've returned. You haven't gone to the inn, have you? No, nothing. I was just worried about you. Do be careful. I would hate to hear of something untoward happening to you. I am merely an assistant to a poor scholar. I fetched his tea and warmed his slippers by the fire. Occasionally, I would help him organize his notes. The legend states that Andraste's ashes were stolen by her followers and hidden away. Brother Genitivi knew more about it, but he was secretive about his discoveries. He was an elderly man, kind, a little eccentric. He was very devoted to his quest for the urn of sacred ashes and spent many hours buried in his books and his notes. His research was his life. Yes. What are you doing? You're not supposed to go in there. I'm sorry, but that room is not for guests. It's full of books and papers, and I'd rather they were not disturbed. I said no. Ginny TV was a very private person. No, don't touch that door! Going. Ah! Yes.
Dwarven craft. Fine dwarven craft. Direct from Orzama. Welcome. Welcome. In times like this, surely every... Dwarven crafts. Find dwarven crafts. Direct from Orzammar. You won't find better. <laughs> <laughs> 